Oh, is it great to see this guy make the walk here tonight. Really as accomplished a striker as we've seen come into the UFC in years. And no surprise, he'll be interested in keeping the fight standing tonight. We'll see if he can put on a striking clinic. If the takedown defense holds up, figures to have a pronounced advantage on the feet. This guy has ruthless one-punch knockout power. You can't teach it, but when a fighter has it, it's a huge advantage. All right, so here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and the man Dana White calls the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is making the walk tonight. This is perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. Great combination of speed and power, and the power is really set up by his precision, his dynamic striking style, his timing. Bruce Lee was quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. No one has been more adaptable than this man, Lee, comma, Bruce. This fighter has outstanding footwork. He is amongst the best in the world at changing angles and always being in a position where he can land against his opponent, but he's out of range of his opponent's counterattacks. Our tail of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. More than five years apart, with the same height and some differences in reach. We send it inside the octagon. The veteran voice is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon is Herb T. And now, this is the moment you've all been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, it is... This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record of 16 wins, two losses, and one no contest. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds, fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, USA. Tom Fire King Duquesne. And now we can see the opponent. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting at Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been given your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch him up, man. We are underway. You ready to fight? You ready? All right, here we go. That one hurt. to get those hands up. Hit him with the jab. And he continues to work on the inside of that lead leg. Outstanding kick there by Duke Anwar. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, that left hand is on point. Lee gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Really missed with that right hand. Oh, and he goes up top with a kick. Head kick! Oh, and there's a sharp lead hook by Lee. Oh! A couple of chins here being tested early. Well, he absorbs a kick to the head here, left it wide open. He's got to not move into that power shot. Let's see if he can adjust. 
Duquesne Watt gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Oh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Lee. Duquesne Watt gets caught with that punch. Oh, flying knees. Head kick! Take down, take down, take down! Nice jab. Hard shots landing on both sides here. He got hit with the left hook. Midway through round one. Such good movement in there. Nice jab there by Duke and Walk. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Oh, he's always on the counterattack, but a nice leg kick there by Duquesne. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell Big short. shots being landed on both sides here. Tagged him. He caught that one right on the knee. That could have hurt. Nice jab. Misses with that punch. That's again the experience. Under two minutes to go. Right hand upstairs. There's the leg kick. That one checked by Lee. We'll see if he can finish. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Oh, effective use of the jab by Lee. Just missed with that right hand. Duquesne was lower jaw now, Joe, starting to show some signs of swelling. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught to the head. He is done. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. He's got him hurt here. Forty-five seconds to go here in round one. Gets hit by that leg kick. Nice shot to the body there. Oh, he missed that kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. Tagged him. Tried to land the punch, but a swing and a miss by Lee. Round two straight ahead. Oh, Let's take a look at it again here. Here's a nasty head kick that lands. Here's a powerful head kick that lands. Incredible striking on display in that round. Here's some water. And listen, your kicks are working. Brittany Palmer is in the building doing work as usual. Ready for it? Ready. Second round on the road. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast and try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Oh, no, the left leg goes high. Lands a hard kick. Nice head kick. Well, he's 
landed some excellent shots in this fight tonight, but more often than not, it has been one and done. So the emphasis now moving forward, combinations. Throw your punches in bunches and really try to force the issue and get your opponent out of it. How about that shin? He missed that kick. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Strong inside leg kick. Oh, and there's the spinning back fist, Joe. Nice kick to the leg. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. He tagged him with that right hand. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. These guys are swinging. Good defense there. Trying to establish that jab once again. Man, Joe, he continues to leave that head open. His opponent's got to be salivating at this point in time. That jab has been there all night. You got to get oh, that head off the side. Oh, head kick attempt. It is blocked by Lee. Nice shot. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Oh, nice jab up top by Duquesne one. That shot blocked by Lee. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two. Definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Oh, that's a nice inside leg kick right there. Kick. Oh, huge kick. <laughs> Trying to kick the leg out. Just over two minutes to go. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Ooh! Duke Anwalk gets caught by the inside leg, take a few more, and that'll leave him up. Just misses there with the left. Good shot. Well, you're playing with fire there. He left the body wide open there, and he has shown an increased vulnerability to that strike, Joe, by leaning in, almost moving into the strike to set up his own offense. We'll see if he lowers that guard, lowers those elbows to prevent further damage. Well, you talk about smelling blood in the water. He lands another punch right on that cut in and around his opponent's eye. Nice right hook. Lee gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Oh, that cut has really opened up now, Joe. Duquesne gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Good exchanges from both fighters. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that offer. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. 30 seconds to go in the round. That one hurt. Oh, he got cracked. 20 seconds to go round two. Big hook. 15 seconds. He got tagged there. Oh, tagged him. And the horn sounds on round two. All right, so that's the end of the round, and I'm not sure how he's dealing with the blood at this point in time. That lip has gotten really, really bad. There's blood in the mouth, and you got to think, Joe, this is upsetting his breathing pattern a little bit. And I would think if it gets any worse, the doctor's going to have to get in there and stop the fight. Here we see an excellent kick connects flush with perfect timing. Really?
really excellent striking being displayed in that round. It's okay. We expected this type. The OG Ariane Celeste in the building with us tonight. Third round underway. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Oh! Duquesne Ross lower jaw is just nasty at this point. Really swollen in that area now. Inside leg kick is there by Lee. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe, and his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. Oh, caught him there with the head kick. Effective punch there by Lee. Wow. Oh, big left hand there. How about that chin? Oh, he missed with that right hand. Pretty nice leg kick there, Joe. Good work on the feet by Duquesne. Straight right hand now, just misses. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Lee. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding up. Constantly a moving target. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Blocks the shot. Well, you've got to admire the urgency here. He is trying to keep the judges out of it. Lighten up his opponent left and right. Lee gets caught by the inside leg kick. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Just reached the midway point of the fight. Whiffs on the right hand. Front kick to the body is there. Nice job by Duquesne. Well, fainting with that kick. Went for the inside leg kick. shown a vulnerability tonight by leaning right into that punch as he tries to set up his own offense. May want to focus on some defense here moving forward. Hard inside leg kick lands. He's fainting with that kick. Oh, misses with the jab. Nice knee to the body there by Lee. Oh, he just misses with the right hook there, Joe. Beautiful straight punch there by Duquesne Walk. Doing a nice job working that inside leg kick. Lee's keeping those feet in perpetual motion, circling to his right now. Duquesne Walk gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Gotta shore up the defense here, though. Oh, nice. Oh, he continues to attack that bloody cheek. His face is a mess. Going to the sidekick. Trying to get a head kick in. Roundhouse kick, Joe. Unable to find the target. Lee gets stung by that leg kick. 
Man, this dude is relentless. He just continues to pour it on, really as aggressive as any striker on the roster. Gotta be careful here, Joe, to not gas out, but you at least have to admire the approach. Very effective here in this round. Waning seconds here of round number three. Goes for the head kick, but doesn't connect. And that'll do it, 15 stop, stop, minutes stop. in the books. There's a nice leg kick. And here's another beautiful leg kick. And there's another excellent leg kick. Settle down. Excellent job. Deep breaths, calm down. Very good controlling the distance. Very good disengage and re-engage. I need to... Ariane Celeste in the building as usual. round now, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. So far, phenomenal performance that we're so privileged to be able to watch. Oh. Just misses with the straight left hand. Excellent head movement. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. found the target. Nice one, two there. Let's try to establish that jab. Lee's bruise on his thigh is looking very bad at this point, Joe. He is not going to be able to get out of bed tomorrow. Absolutely nasty. How about that chin? Flips the left hand. Well, not a good look there, Joe, as he eats a shot to the body. It looks like he's becoming increasingly more vulnerable to that strike. Certainly left the body wide open on that. Beautiful combination there by Duquesne. Front kick to the face. Oh, he got tagged there. Straight right, he misses. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Fainting with the punch. Slips the shot. Duquesne gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Looks like his leg is hurt here, Joe. You can see him limping a little bit. All right, less than three minutes to go here in round four. Huge uppercut misses. Oh, slips the punch there, Joe. Duquesne wide gets hit by that leg kick. May not be a bad idea to start to check some of these. Almost hits him with that left hook. Hook attempt, but it's no good. He eats a high one. Under two minutes to go in the round. Head kick lands. Thought there might be an opening for the punch there, Joe. Instead, a swing and a miss by Lee. Duquesne Watt gets caught by the inside leg. Oh, that cut has really opened up now, Joe. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Let's 
So again, he's absorbing damage to the body here, Joe. He's been vulnerable to it all night long, and there it is again. You gotta be careful to not move into your opponent's striking range unless your guard is in the right place. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Lee. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. He's able to slip the left. Clean with the right hook. Nice inside leg kick. Oh, that's a good strike there by Duquesne. Slips to avoid the right. Fifteen seconds to go. Good shot. Ten seconds remaining here in round four. Jam. Oh, both men exchange. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. Twenty minutes in the books. All right, that's the end of five minutes. That's the end of the round. You see the cut on his lip, and that thing is only getting worse. Pretty nasty gash at this point in time. You know he's going to need some sutures after the fact. The focus right now, though, keeping his head in the game. Don't think about the cut. You got to think about getting your offense going and shoring up that defense to prevent that cut from getting any worse. Take control of it. Take control of it. Move forward. When he sets on you, take him down. And then just keep mixing it up. Give me those kicks, too, baby. Give me those kicks, too. Ariane Celeste with us tonight. Ready to fight? Ready. Fifth and final round. Going to the body now with that hook well placed there by Duquesne Wong. Flips the punch. He blocks the punch. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Flipped him with the jab. Back to the well with that right hand. It's no good. And a high kick. Straight right hand, no good. Caught him in the punch. How about that shin? Lee's eye continues to swell shut here. Well, looks as though his leg is hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. He's moving to his right, trying to avoid that big right hand. Duquesne gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Well, missed on that one. Oh, that'll ring your bell. Head kick. Lee going for the leg kick. Nothing doing there. So again, he moves forward somewhat carelessly, and again, he pays for it, Joe. Left the body wide open, and his opponent took full advantage. He landed that punch flush. Going to the head kick now, Joe. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Front kick to the body by Duquesne Wong. Nice. Effective strike there by Lee. Under three minutes now to go round five. So clock starting to become a factor here. Goes to the body there. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Lee. Block that kick to the body. He's got a beautiful leg kick. Ooh, yeah, these nice are what you say about my mother check. punches. hook. 
Two minutes now to go in this one. They're both landing bombs on each other. Oh, beautifully placed with that lead hook by Lee. Oh, landed it. Swing and a big miss by Lee. Push kick there to the body. Oh, major bruising going on here, Joe. Look at that right thigh. Oh. Whenever you see a fighter's legs stiffen up like that, that's not a good sign. Got cracked to the head there, Joe. He's gonna have to change things up here with his footwork, with his tempo. He continues to be vulnerable to that strike coming back. Gotta get his head off the center line. Nice hook there by Duque. Those punches are very hard. Under a minute now to go in the fight. Misses with the right hand. Oh, nice leg kick. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Slips. Oh, and he ate a front kick. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Not there. by that flush straight punch. Nice job by the offense there. That one hurt. Duquesne Watt gets caught with that punch. Wow, what a fight. All right, so this one will go to a decision. Should be a clear winner here tonight. He was the dominant fighter, really, from the opening horn to the closing one. We await the judges' scorecards, but he should get his hand raised here tonight. And again, here in round two, beautiful technique here. Times that strike perfectly. And round three, another great, accurate shot. And here we are in round four. We see another shot landing right on target. And in the final round, excellent timing again on that strike. Official decision now in, the buff has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest. 49-46. For the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! So the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the martial arts legend tonight. This man, of course, has had no shortage of challengers since coming to the UFC. And more often than not, he has had an answer.